afternoon this is teacher I I would like to welcome you in my classroom in my math classroom yes it's not a uh, reading today so it's all about math so I would just like to share to you some approach on how to teach multiplication so when you have to uh, show them like this and then ask them um, how to memorize it so medyo mahirap for ano, for them so uh, i mean or i have i give them strategy on how to understand and why there's an answer for that um set of multiplication so it's actually it's not all about memorization so i explain to them how does this number get this answer so that they would um understand well and appreciate the multiplication table yes okay let's go you could see it there there's already an answer so sometimes the kids would uh would not understand how does this um answer arrive okay so let's have the solution and show them how it was how was the answer given okay so here it is so by the way uh prerequisite for this multiplication should be uh the child knows how to um add and the child should uh should know how to how do you call that how to skip count yeah Okay, so let's start. I usually uh, start with a zero. So I always tell them that multiply any number by zero and you still have zero. So any number that is multiplied to zero is equals to zero. So you're going to write so one times zero is zero. Yeah. Okay, there. And then, so all the numbers should be with zero and then after that so with one so here's the multiplication one there okay so it's one 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 okay i would always tell them one always let the other number win okay so yeah. one always let the other numbers or the other number win so it's one times one so the, this one should be the winner okay so it should be so since one times one so this is the winner so it's one okay there Ayan. and then we also have one times two so again one always always lets the other number win so it's one times two so what's the other number with um, aside from one is two okay so let's write two there next one so one times three so three should be the winner because one will let the other number win there okay and then one times four okay yes very good it should be four because one will let number four win yes okay next one 1 times 5 is equals to 5 because 1 will let number 5 win. Yes. Okay. Napaka giving naman ni number 1. Okay. Next one. Okay. We have 1 times 6. Okay. So, again, 1 will let number 6 to win. So, it's 6. And then, 1 times 7 yes correct it's seven okay and then next one one times eight is yes one will let number eight wins okay very good and how about this one one times nine is equal to nine okay so always the the Number one will let the other number wins. So as this one times ten. Yes, very good. Okay, there. 
So we have the 1 times 0 is 0. 1 times 1 is 1 because 1 we let the other number wins. 1 times 2, number 1 we let number 2 to win. 1 times 3, number 1 is equals to 3 because the 1 will let number 3 wins. Also, 1 times 4, it should be 4 because 1 again will let number 4 to win. 1 times 5 is equals to 5 because... Okay, so it's sobrang giving me number 1, so on and so forth. Yes! Okay, so what are we going to do? Okay, let's put it down again. So let's review first for our... 0 and 1. Yes! Okay, I have here, there. Okay, so we have again, so any number or multiply any number to 0, you will still have 0. So 0 times 0 is 0. zero 1 times 0, it's 0 because there's a 0. 2 times 0 is another 0 because there's a 0. 3 times 0. 0 is another 0. 4 times 0 is another 0. Yes. 5 times 0 is another 0. 6 times 0 is another 0. 7 times 0, another 0. 8 times 0, another 0. 9 times 0, another 0. And 1 10 times 0 is another 0. Even if you will multiply the 0 to 1,000, to 100, still the answer is 0. Yes, because, again, multiply any number by 0, you will still have 0. Yes, okay, let's check if you understand. Okay, for a while, I'll change my marker. Okay, there. Okay, hmm, louder so I can hear your answer. 2 times 0? Yes, it's 0 because there's a 0, so it should be 0. There, another? 8 times 0? Yeah, it's 0. 9 times 0? Yes. 4 times 0? Yes. 7 times 0? Yes! 6 times 0? Yes! 0! 3 times 0? Yeah! Very good! 5 times 0? Yes, it's 0! 10 times 0? Yes, it's 0 again! 1 times 0? It's 0 again! How about 0 times 0? Okay, it's 0 again! There! So all is zero let's go and let's review with our one again one will let the other number wins okay zero times one it's zero one times one it's one one times two is two one okay three times one rather is three four times one is 4. It will let the other numbers have 5 times 1. Yes, that's correct. It's 5. Because it will let the 5 win. Okay. 6 times 1. Okay. Good job. 7 times 1. Yes. 8 times 1. Yes. 9 times 1. Yes. And 10 times 1. Then, very good. Okay, let's have our drill. Let's see if you have, if you answer, you answer it correctly. What's this? One times one. Yes, it's one. Okay. Next. Wait lang. Ha. Okay. Next, we have zero times one. It's zero. Nine times one. Let the number nine win. Six times one. Yes, it's six. Okay, fix ko lang ha. Ayan. Okay, next one. Two times one. 
Yes, let number two win. Okay. Next, four times one. Yes, it's four. I will let number four win. Again, eight times one. Very good. It's eight. And three times one. Yes, it's three. Five times one. It's five and seven times one yes it's seven and ten times one ten very good okay there so there if you could see it okay good job okay so i hope you learned from our lesson for today okay so i will have some series on this uh, multiplication so this is all about so Today, we, uh, you've learned about multiplication or multiplying numbers by 1 and by 0. Okay, so next time, I will have the uh, multiplying numbers by uh, 2 and by 5. Okay, so there. Thank you very much. Hope you enjoy and you learn a lot. Okay, so...